you guys have to welcome back to another video. And um, last video I recorded with Fraps, and I did like uh, 60 FPS or something with half size. And I found the quality when I uploaded to YouTube was actually quite horrible. So I'm back to using Camtasia. So tell me what you think of this um, quality of this video, because I'm actually using um, I'm actually recording in the 19, I believe it's 1920 by like 1018 or something like that. Um, but you like you see, I'm um, I'll just use this quickly. But like you'll see, I am just it's a massive screen pretty much. And um, I think it's like I I think I prefer watching other people's videos when they're when I can see the entire screen rather than just like a little a little um 1280 by 720. Um, but just to start off the video, I just found in my bank. I um oh, hold up, what is this? 62k. Oh, champion. Um, so I just found a bunch of these pendants in my bank, and they're all just like prismatic pendants and prized pig prized. I don't know, just <laughs> gypsy pendants. And I found out that you can just click on the skill. And you can just, hold on a second, gain XP. And you can just gain all the XP. So, I'm just gaining all the XP in Divination. I have 230k, one sec. But yeah, I'm just gaining all the XP in Divination right now. So, spam, click on the Pendant. And then spam, click on the Pendant. And I'll just do this for the other ones. Because you can only use it um, with one skill at a time, I think. And then, once you use it on the skill, you can just basically delete the pendant and then just gain all the XP. Look at that. 344k bonus XP in Divination, which is absolutely fantastic. Um, that's a 344k less XP I have to get, so I'm going to destroy all of these pendants because they suck. Um, and yes, okay, sweet. So I keep the so I keep the um, XP. That would have sucked a lot. And then I can delete the um, pendant of agility because no one want, no one just wears the pendants for their looks. Um, but I'm going to get started with some agility because my next 99 is going to be agility, not divination. But I'm going to quickly show you how I get to the um, Barbarian Outpost. If you don't know, you must have been hiding under a rock. But you just get the games, Nicholas, and you teleport to the Barbarian Outpost. But uh, today, um, there was actually, yes, no, two days ago, I, um, I had a few, oh my gosh. Wait, so, not yes, was it yesterday? No, it was the day before yesterday. I had a few mates over at my house. And um, we all played um, some COD, FIFA, and some GTA and stuff, and with some Titanfall as well. And what we, there was about there was about eight or seven of us over, I believe, um, in general, or no, in total. And we were all down like the other end of my house. Now, if you remember watching the setup video, uh, where the, the room that the drum kit was in, I moved my PC down there, and I have two screens set up. So I've got my double monitor set up, and I've got um, the a 32-inch TV, a 42-inch TV. And then my other mate brought his 24-inch uh, monitor as well. So we were up here. We were down here all night for quite a while. We were playing some FIFA and stuff. And it was it was a great night. And that brings me to my next point. Now, in the last few months, I've made two setup videos. And if you want me to make kind of like a... Oh my gosh, what's this like? If you want me to, if you want me to make like a, another setup video showing you how my PC is set up right now, um, feel free to let me in the comments. Feel free to let me know in the comments, sorry. And I mean, I'll be sure to make one of those setup videos for you guys if you want. Because I know I've been uploading, like, I know I've just uploaded another setup video. But this setup's quite good. It's got, like, a, there's, like, a table setup. And then my, my, um, my speakers are on the other side of the monitors. And the monitors are just chilling there. And then I've got a bunch of wires behind the table as well, which is awesome. Um, hopefully the house doesn't burn down, but it won't. Because I've, I'm making sure everything's all G. Um, but yeah. But yeah, I had a couple of my friends over. Uh, because my, um, parents were up, were up in Queensland. Up in North Queensland. And, um... My sister was home, um, but she was like sleeping and stuff. So I had a few of my friends over, and we basically just like we basically just chilled out and we went down the other end of the house. And like I said, we had three TVs set up and my double monitor set up. So on my screen, because um, with my two screens, I can have I've kind of I've linked one of my screens to both my PC and my Xbox, and the other screen is just for PC. So right now I'm recording with like Audacity and uh, Camtasia and stuff on one of my screens and playing RuneScape in full screen on the on the other screen. So um, so that's what I'm using the double screen for now. But uh, because I play quite a bit of Call of Duty, I, um, I'll AFK Divination on the screen that you're looking at right now and I'll... Um, change the import of the of the second screen to the um to the Xbox and that's what I'll do. But last night I wasn't um I wasn't no the night before I wasn't playing RuneScape, I was just playing I had Titanfall open on my PC. So on one of my screens I had Titanfall um and um on my other screen I had Call of Duty. And then my other mates had like FIFA on the big screen so that was like two player with the Xbox one 
and on the other screen there was Call of Duty and then there was like GTA on the other screen so we're just having a having a chill out and if you guys are wondering what to do if you're like at home maybe for a weekend or something and you finished all your uh, all your schoolwork and if you finish just work for the week and just want something to do to chill out if you have a few mates that like playing video games and stuff it's always awesome just to have them over if you have a big enough room and if they have their TV and stuff and they can bring it over it's always a wise idea just to get them to bring it over and um, play some games it's a nice just way to chillax and uh, have some friends over and basically give you some company I guess because otherwise I would just be at home getting XP by myself which isn't um, which can be quite de tedious and boring but yeah on the whole it was a good night and it was also good because my t seeing as my Titanfall was open the entire night um, my mates were getting me some XP because Titanfall is quite good on the PC um, to be honest wait I had Titanfall on the PC going and my other mate had Titanfall on the Xbox One um, uh, in my opinion, the, the quality on the Xbox One is a lot better than the PC. Um, now, I've kind of ramped it up to max settings and stuff on my PC, but um, it still manages to um, not be as good as the Xbox One. But basically, I had the um, game open all day, no, all night on the PC, and when I, the last game I played, I was level 12, and then um, after that, my mates were playing and stuff all night, and then the I'm currently level 29, and I haven't played since I was level 12. So they were they were going ham on the Xbox, no, on the on Titanfall all the night, and um, yeah, so they got me some beast XP. But that's basically all I want to speak to you guys um, in this commentary today, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. Please give it a like if you did, and leave me a comment and stuff. I always love reading all the comments because I don't I don't get that many. Um, but that's the, basically the whole reason why I make YouTube videos is to interact with you guys. But hopefully you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next video. Background, I've got some Barbarian Assault gameplay. And that's because I'm getting 99 agility next. And I've currently got 500k.